there are dressing packs 14 or is it 13 hold on okay so it's going on what do you mean you you're all over the place losing count forgetting what things are called okay but you've got to promise to keep it a secret and not say anything till later you had me a secret well you know that i've been racking my brains trying to think of someone to fix up with simon i didn't but go on well i think i've found someone <gasps> who He's an American guy called Todd. <laughs> of course he is. Todd. He's a cousin of a school friend. He travels back and forth. He's an actual rocket scientist. Good looking, apparently. Okay, are you sure that Todd, the American good looking rich rocket scientist, is actually real? Mm. Yeah, we are going to give him the once over before you set them up though, yeah? Yeah, of course. I'm going to meet him today for a late lunch. And if he passes, I'm going to book him an appointment with Simon for later on this afternoon. Who's that? Uh, Todd Delaney. He's American. He's not registering with us, so I put him down as an overseas patient. Also known as your 430. And which shoulder is it? Oh, the right shoulder. I was playing tennis. And does it hurt all the time, or just when you move it? Uh, it's just a little uncomfortable when I move it is all. I'm I don't want to make a big deal out of it. Okay. If you just take your shirt off, Mr. Delaney, we'll have a look at it. I didn't think you guys actually did that. Oh, well, it's just so we can examine. But if you'd rather not... Oh, no, no, no. The, um, the Mr. Delaney stuff. It's very British. Very charming. Okay. Right. Would you just like to stand up for me? And can you lift your arm like this? Do you play a lot of tennis and like this? When you're professional or anything? Oh, no, no, I just enjoy the exercise. Plus, it's a good way to meet people when you're on the move like I am. And like this? It's just that you look very fit. Um, you know, as if you play a lot or something. Let me know if this feels tender. Uh, I run a bit and work out. Um, nope, that feels good. Um, how about you? You look in good shape. Is that a gym body rippling under there? No, I, I don't think so. Not much rippling under there. I am a member of a gym, but I don't know why. I worked out last year, it cost me about £100 per visit. <clears throat> Can you take guests? Uh, we should go together. Any minute. Unless he ever runs. What you give him? A stiff shoulder. That way he can take his top off. Ooh, is oh, is he buff? Oh, oh yeah, not as bummed as you thought, hey? <laughs> <laughs> now come in. Can't see me. You're kidding, you actually got to look through the Mount Graham telescope in Arizona. The very one. That must have been incredible. It's got an aperture of, what, 11 metres or something? 11.8. You certainly know your telescopes. <laughs> so, um... So, uh, I guess all that's left is for me to say thanks and ask you out for a drink. Why isn't he saying anything? Oh, um... Look, I'd, I'd really like to, but I can't. Really, doctor, patient. Hey, you're not my doctor. Um, I'm cured. Look. Um, okay. Why not? Great. Um, here's my card. Oh, right. Um, here's mine. Oh, one sec. Just my mobile number. Oh, your cell. <laughs> mobile. That's cute. <laughs> okay, so, um, I'll call you. <laughs> Guess what I got? What? A date with a hot American aerospace oh, engineer. Oh, that is brilliant. Totally out of the blue. That's amazing. You didn't have anything to do with this, did you? I don't know anything about it. Cherry? Honestly? Why would I meet a rocket scientist? Cherry? I should have known. Come in. Oh, it's you. I don't want to talk to you. Oh, come on.
Come on, Simon. I was only trying to do you a favour, that's all. It was completely inappropriate and unprofessional. I could report you to the Royal College of Nursing. Oh, don't be so stuffy. He's into you and you got a date, didn't you? A date that I clearly can't go on. Oh, I really don't think... Exactly it, isn't it, Cherry? You don't think. No, I mean it. Please leave. Well, the long face. Shouldn't you be doing the clever me dance? I don't think Simon thinks that I'm too clever. Oh, don't worry about him. He'll be fine once he's been on the date. I don't think he's going to go. Ugh, such a mess. Well, it can't be that bad. He's not going on his date and he hates me. Come on. And he's also talking about reporting me to the RCN. What is it they say? The only clever blondes are golden retrievers. This thug saw his opportunity and took it. Yeah, I just happened to have. I lay and I came to get it, came to 